Is this the right time to come to Germany or is it not? Are there any jobs available right now? What is the inflation rate? I get at minimum on an average 100 applicants that apply for the job role. There are less jobs available. However, there are more people applying for the job. So the number of people who have migrated to Germany since 2023 are around 1.1 million. What is the current unemployment rate for Germany? The question to ask yourself is when is the right time to move? everybody welcome to my channel goodreads in germany and in today's video we are going to discuss what are the current market insights for germany is this the right time to come to germany or is it not are there any jobs available right now what is the inflation rate is germany actually undergoing a recession and many more such topics we are going to discuss in this video so that you understand the current market state for germany which will help you decide whether you should move to Germany or whether you should not. So let's get started. I am Gurpreet and I work in Germany as a lead HR and I hire a lot of different candidates. And also I talk to different recruiters in the same industries, the consultancies and so many other stakeholders. So definitely I can give you some insights on the current job market situation for Germany. So basically the process here goes is whenever you post a job ad, you wait for first two weeks to collect some resumes and see how many people are applying for the job. So one and a half years before when I used to post a job on LinkedIn and wait for two weeks, I used to get on an average 30 to 40 candidates applying for that job role. However, in today's market right now, if I post a job ad on LinkedIn, after two weeks, I get at minimum on an average 100 applicants that apply for the job role. So that itself says that the current job market in Germany right now is a bit competitive. There are less jobs available. However, there are more people applying for the jobs. There are more candidates looking for the jobs. No doubt about it. That is the current state of German job market. So the competition has increased, but the jobs that are available right now are still at the same growth or are still less. Now let's talk more about this job market. So the number of people who have migrated to Germany since 2023 are around 1.1 million. These are only the immigrants that I'm talking about. Yes, 1.1 million people have migrated to Germany since 2023. So that itself shows that there are more people coming into the country. However, whether everybody has the job opportunity or not, that data is proven by the unemployment rate for Germany. So let's understand what is the current unemployment rate for Germany. Unemployment rate for Germany in 2023 was around 5.7 percent. However, as per June 2024, the unemployment rate has increased to 6 percent. So what is all this data telling us? All this data is clearly telling us that there are more people who are unemployed there are less jobs available and that itself contributes to a lot of competition right now in the current German job market. So there is no hiding from this fact that if you come to Germany for a job search, then finding a job here is not going to be that easy or not going to be that straightforward. One more example of this is, as you know, Germany had a job seeker visa. Job seeker visa allowed you to come to Germany for six months to find a job. However, now that job seeker visa is converted into Chancenkarte or Opportunity Card. Now, Opportunity Card allows you to come to Germany for 12 months to find a job. So somewhere, even government realized that six months is maybe not enough for job seekers to land a successful job. And that is why they also increased this duration from six months to 12 months which is you get one year to find a stable job for yourself here in Germany. I'm not trying to scare you, but I am trying to tell you the current uh, job market. In case if you are coming to Germany on Opportunity Card or you are already living in Germany and trying to find a job right now in the current market, then definitely you have to put in more effort compared to what you would put last previous years. So you have to stand out from for your application from these 100 applicants. But still understand, we have 100 people applying for the job. 
but still finding the right talent the right quality talent which actually matches the job is still difficult for the recruiters even after getting so many resumes i still feel that the resume or the skills that i'm looking for the job getting that becomes difficult so it's while i understand that market is competitive i'm also telling you as a recruiter that still finding a right talent is challenging job here in germany but nothing is impossible if you have a right technique of creating the right resume understanding the german culture and then you have that dedicated attitude that come what may no matter if there are less jobs available in the market no matter if there is more competition available in the market but i believe in my skills i know what i get onto the table and if you have that dedication then definitely you can find a job here in germany and in case if you are coming on opportunity card then you have one year to find a job and i personally feel one year is a big time to find a job here in germany but there are two things which are very important here one is your dedication that contributes to 60% of a successful job search journey here in germany and second 40% is contributed by the right technique now right technique comes from the very first step of how do you apply for jobs how do you create the resume and then how do you understand the german culture and attend the interviews but worry not in case if you want to learn this technique or you want to understand how do you create a perfect cv for german market so that your application stands out from this current competitive market that we have in germany you can take this crash course that i have created and that's really going to help you or any case if you want to talk to me then i am going to help you as well making sure that you create a perfect resume as per german market so that you start getting more interview calls the honest answer to this question is in the current job market yes the competition is high the jobs are less but that doesn't mean that the german market is completely under recession let's talk about this is german market completely under recession well to be honest the answer to that is no there is no recession that is happening in the german market yes honestly speaking the number of jobs which companies are opening up have reduced drastically so for example if a company a was hiring for around 100 positions last year and this year maybe that company a will have around 15 to 20 open positions so definitely there is a decrease in the open positions but you also have to understand why there is a decrease so what we have understood after talking to so many people is lot of companies overhired in germany in last few years and when they overhired so much definitely the revenue has decreased but the cost for the companies have increased and now what most of the companies are doing is they are trying to stabilize their growth so basically they are not trying to overhire right now and they are going through some cost optimization so most of the companies right now are stabilizing their growth because of the overhiring that was done in the past so that is what is happening in germany right now the companies are stabilizing but you also have to understand once this stabilization is done then the companies will start rehiring again but that does not mean that germany is under recession right now that is not true but yes definitely comparatively there are less jobs available and there is more talent in the market right now now let's understand the current inflation rate here in germany the inflation rate in germany in 2023 was skyrocketed to 7.3% that is definitely very high but now in 2024 the inflation rate is trying to get more stabilized and it is not drastically increasing as much as what it was in 23 right now as per may 2024 the inflation rate has decreased to 2.4% so definitely it is decreasing and the government is trying to take care of the inflation cost now the reason why the inflation rate drastically increased in 
are the repercussions of all these different activities that are happening out there so as you know there is a there is a war going on between russia and ukraine so basically germany was highly dependent on russia for their energy needs this energy needs were satisfied by russia at a very minimal cost however due to this war the connection between russia and germany has little bit become difficult and the energy that germany was getting from russia is no longer available and now germany is trying to get these energy sources from different countries now when germany is trying to get this energy from different countries definitely the cost to get that energy is much higher and all this contributed to the inflation rate increase here in germany but what is happening right now is government is trying to become more strict and there is more saving that is happening on the energy front so that they start taking care of the inflation rate here in germany but on the other hand to to be more precise to take care of this inflation rate here in germany and the sudden increase german government did provide some inflation cost to all the employees working here in germany around 3000 euro net was distributed to all employees to take care of the inflation cost now this was dependent on the companies but most of the companies have distributed this 3000 euro net so this is how government takes care of yes there are issues we realize the issues but also they try to take care of how do we solve these issues another example that i can give you is when there are so many immigrants that move to berlin definitely the current situation to find a house here in germany is difficult it's not easy so there was another one such example where in berlin the rent increases drastically and everybody used to charge anything so for example if a apartment was on rent say previously at 800 euro per month drastically the rent prices increased to 1200 euros per month and there was actually no cap for the rent but then government realized that that the rent owners or the apartment owners are trying to make take an advantage of this sudden increase of immigrants in the city and then government made sure that you know the owners cannot drastically increase the rent however they have to follow what is in the law so in case if you are paying way high rent here in germany then feel free to contact a lawyer and understand is this rent that you are paying actually as per the law or it is not and if it is not then you can always go back to your owner and talk to them and try to see if they can reduce the rent however we spoke about the job market we spoke about the inflation rate we also spoke about the housing here in germany yes finding a house here in germany is difficult but but everybody figures out something or the other right so at the end things do work out now should you come to germany or should you not in the current situation well let me be very honest it might take you some more time to find a job it might not happen that immediately you come to germany and you will get a job but the question to ask yourself is when is the right time to move how are you sure that in next two years the situation is going to get better and not worse so nobody is sure about that so the question that you have to ask yourself is are you ready to give 100% in case if you take this move to come to germany you might need to try a bit more than what you would try in previous years but are you ready to give your 100% right now knowing the current market situation to find a job here in germany and what is your risk taking appetite basically how much risk can you take right now in your current life in your current situation and then take this decision so nobody can answer this question for you whether this is a right time to come to germany or not you have to decide whether this is a right time for you or not and how much effort are you ready to put in to find your next job here in germany now let me give you an example yes the current situation i told you there are less jobs and there is more competition more candidates available in the market but trust me I have my clients that work with me and they came here on a job seeker visa and I'm surprised 
there are people who have got job just in two months even on job seeker visa without knowing german language without having any experience in the german market but still they were able to find the job and secure a job on the other hand there are few people who are still trying to find a job so basically what i'm trying to say is irrespective of whatever the situation is happening you have to understand you need just one job and you have to bang on that job on your skills do not think about how is the market how is the situation be very confident that i am going to give my 100% and i am going to find a job for myself if you have that dedication and if you have a right technique nobody can stop you from getting a job here in germany but do not waste your time in getting carried away with all a uh, new things that german a country provides you and do not waste your time by using the same old format of resumes or interview technique that you were doing in your home country that will slow down your progress and that will not help you getting the job sooner so be honest to yourself are you ready to give 100% in the current market to find a job if the answer is yes then i would say go for it do not double guess and just make sure you are dedicated enough to find your next job here in germany so this was a quick video to show you what was the current market situation here in germany in case if you want to talk to me if you have any doubts regarding germany feel free to book my one to one consultation i will talk to you and i can also give you feedback on your resume the main question is as a recruiter will i select your resume or will i reject your resume i will give you this transparent feedback you can book my one to one personalized consultation for resume review or in any case if you want to just take the crash course to learn how to create a perfect cv for germany then go ahead and click on the link below in the description section i am goodpreet and i share lot of insight information about germany with detailed videos so go ahead click on the like and subscribe button in case if you like what i'm doing that really gives me a lot of motivation i hope to see you again keep watching my videos bye